Hi guys, welcome back to this 2000 Gaming again for another Pokemon TCG Pocket. So if you're enjoying the content in this channel, please do consider subscribing. That would really inspire me making more videos such as this one. So please do support this small channel moving forward. So we're gonna be talking about the importance of the event, the Lapras event. Just imagine, within that event, I cannot say enough of this event. This event is fairly easy if you have like... Uh, if you have an electric type or if you have a like a very built-in half enough deck you're still gonna be able to clear this and again clearing the lapras event the harder you go or expert or uh, advanced you will be getting surefire promo card pulls okay but we don't know what you'll get but inside there's lots of things that you can mix and match in order for you to build a good deck moving forward and some of these decks are crazy. Some of these, these decks are crazy. Crazy meta decks right now that can counter even Pikachus and the Mewtwo's out there. So, um, if you go to your solo here, go to your Lapras EX. So, when you go here, it will tell you information, promo packs. Inside the promo packs, you have this, okay? Firstly, you have a Mankey. If you have, a, like, a Prime Ape, in your pokedex lying around you can you'll be able to get get a prime ape and a monkey you have already a deck if you have lots there's, there's gonna be a sand slash um cards there lying around because you're pulling all, all the time because sand slash is not very like it's very easy to get sand slash sand shrew and sand slash so you already had a deck sand slash with monkey that's already one deck or if you want to mix and match you can have a marowak deck Marowak Monkey Deck, which is really OP right now. Uh, it's He can gobble up even the psychic enemies like Mewtwo decks and even the Pikachu deck. So, Monkey, like Prime Ape Marowak is really good. And then, we go to the Butterfree one. We all know that Butterfree, you can get it in Booster Pack, in the Booster Pack. But again, you can specifically target Butterfree here if you are lucky enough to get the RNG. I already got four Butterfrees. So, I already have two. Now I can make an Executor Butterfree Healing Team. Okay, made out of two Executors and two Butterfree. Or you can go Venusaur Butterfree, but like that's gonna be very difficult because you have uh, four of each like evolutions. It's harder, but I feel like Butterfree and Executor would be much better. And then if you want to shift other than Executor and Butterfree, if you have a very few amounts of plant-based monster or pokemons <laughs> i call it monster pokemon pocket monster so you can choose like any any green decks that you have or plant deck i call it green because like man i'm playing magic cards in the past i call them plant the green decks anyways so butterfree with any cards moving forward that's gonna be crazy okay with erica and then potion if you want so like those two cards you can make and then also lapras ex this is a very very strong wall of defense if you're using her using Lapras, you can use Lapras with Articuno. You can use Lapras with Starmie. You can use Lapras and Omastar. Like lots of things, you can use Lapras and Tentacruel. Lots of things, and you can use even Lapras and Dr Dragonite. If you have a Dragonite deck um, that you want to build, you can use Lapras moving forward. Uh, it's really really cool to have this kinds of like decks. We also have a Pikachu one if you want to have like an fully electric electric type of deck together with like Pikachu, Zapdos, uh, Voltorb, and like Raichu together with Lieutenant Surge. This is gonna be really crazy with the Pikachu. If you're looking for a Pikachu, you, they will be giving this one to you if your RNG is really good. I just wanna point out shoutouts again to the devs and shoutouts to this first event, the main event, Lapras event. I do really like this one. Again, my life, Lapras is flared up. Butterfree, I've collect collected that one. I'll show you my decks anyways that I have been able to build with this event. And they're fairly, fairly, fairly strong. And uh, like I'm really just happy together with my Sabrina and then together with my Misty. So like the Misty one for the blue, I think it's very, very important to have a Misty, Misty deck. So I call this, see, look at this, <laughs> Thick Balls. I call this, like man, I call this Thick Balls thick balls sorry for sorry for that like that's this that not, not that's this is not the one this is not the one um heal my <laughs> i heal my balls okay okay i'm just like uh having fun playing with playing with like you know playing with the <laughs> anyways 
So I have Butterfree and Executor. This is quite a very strong deck, a formidable one to be exact. Like you have Erika's, two Erika's, Pokeball, uh, Oak. So I think this is a good deck, I feel. So and then you can mix and match with, with other green types or other plant-based Pokemons that you want. So I also have, see I also have a Dragon deck here with Lapras, Articuno, and Dratini. So unfortunately I don't have another Dragonite to complete my set. So what I do is Lapras as my wall, uh, Articuno for initial, initial, uh, initial damage if ever. I pull for him and then I got like one set of Dragonite to wipe them all off just to delay the stuff. And then just regular stuff here with like Misty, Sabrina's. Uh, so that's gonna be one of my decks. Again, I wish I have another Dragonite. And then this one for the monkey, I'm really happy that I was able to build this. I have two Prime Apes lying around because I was like pulling like left and right. And then I was able to get Marowak. I got Marowak from... Um, from the initial booster pack that I got and then I was I was able to get Marowak from Wonder Pick. So fairly easy to build. If you have this one, you're fairly sorted. Like same same as Sabrina all around Giovanni for surprise damage. Mr. Mr. Oak Oak uh, Oak and then Pokeballs and then you have XP to swap in between and you have potions. I think these are the best right now. Fairly easy. I was able to build this one. But like with, with good RNG, okay? So lots of things that you can mix and match. Comment down below what do you think about the Lapras event and were you able to build such decks looking like this? Uh, comment down below. I would like to hear from you guys. Sorry about the names. <laughs> uh, sorry about the names. Oh, Master Supremacy, Primal Rage, uh, like tick. <laughs> meow, 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 meow. Uh, dirty Bird. <laughs> I just want to play with my, the, the, play with my decks uh, titles. So it's like, it's funny. Just to make it much more interesting. So, comment down below. I would like to hear from you guys. This is again 300 Gaming and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out. Bye-bye.